Okay, so now I've gotten it properly secured uh, as well as I can do without a bench vise. And uh, we've got the nut off, we've got the bearings out. Now I'm noticing that there's kind of like a uh, transmission fluid colored crystallization going on in here and I'm not quite sure what that is so uh, we have to do a little bit of research to see what's causing that but I'm going to pull off the uh, the first gear here and then we've got that just slides right off after you get that nut off and uh, I'm going to put that in here so it's nice and safe and now we've got the clutch bell We'll just pull the clutch bell right off there. Set that guy aside as well. And now we're looking at the clutch, which looks like it's still in pretty good shape. So my initial fears have pretty much been quelled here, it looks like. Everything is still good in the engine, so. I am a happy camper. Um, what I may do here in a bit is uh, go ahead and take this clutch off so I can get to the second gear and uh, since I'm in, already in here, uh, take a look at the pucks, see if they need a replacing. I'm fairly certain that in the 29 years since this was built, it probably hasn't had new pucks. So uh, more to come on that. 